Welcome, Cancers. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back, Cancers. What's going on, guys? All right. So, on your way in the building, guys, make sure you hit the thumbs up. Thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up. As well as if you're new to my channel, go ahead in and click the subscribe button because you don't want to miss out on more videos. All right. So. We're going into you guys' birthday month. <laughs> so let's get it popping. Let's see what energy is coming towards you for the month of June. June, all right? So um, if you have Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, this message could apply to you. If it does not apply, let it fly, okay? Don't get in the comment section because I do, I do bark back, okay? I bite back too. All right, so let's get it popping. Give me an overall message for my cancers, please. Give me an overall message for my cancers. All right. See, we got the five of cups, okay? We got the five of cups here. So someone here is crying over spilled milk. Someone here is upset. Someone here is possibly having regrets, okay? It could possibly be about a leap of faith, a move, okay? Um possibly moving too fast we got the six of swords okay so there could have been like you know feeling like you were moving too fast okay please give me the rest of the message for cancers for the month of june ace of pentacles okay so maybe there's a missed opportunity so maybe you feel like you missed the opportunity okay it could possibly be in regards to a work situation with the three of pentacles and the hermit card here someone possibly was looking for a job looking for work um maybe you feel like you missed the opportunity okay yeah we got the tower card here yeah like you're surprised you're shocked uh about this Queen of Pentacles, yeah, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. But there's something definitely here about um, a missed opportunity, okay? So you feel like you missed some type of opportunity, okay? I feel like some of you are trying to, uh, trying to bounce around something, okay? Why is the past, what's the past energy for Cancers? Okay, we got the judgment card. All right, so I'm getting the congratulations here. We got the six of wands and the judgment card. So that's most definitely like great news. Okay, so in past MG, you were getting like some great, great news here. Maybe you were getting a second chance on something or you, you woke up to a situation and realized something here. All right, for future energy. We got the two of cups, okay? So there's a union here, a bond that you may have with someone, okay? Could be um, a Virgo. I got Aquarius here, and I also got Leo, okay? So I feel, I'm off the top, I'm getting that someone here is looking for some type of hope. Um, and I'm also getting that maybe you guys are feeling like you had to distance yourself with the Hermit card here. I'm getting that they're made see, yeah. See, we got the King of Cups and the Five of Wands and the Six of Cups. So there is some type of disagreement in the past, okay? Because I got the Five of Wands um, in the reverse, Conflict, Six of Cups, okay? So this is something that happened in the past. Something, some type of disagreement happened in the past, okay? And for some of you, it could be a separation here with the Four of Wands and the Three of Swords. So you may be separated. A fight broke out. You may be contemplating on divorce, but I'm getting that there was a split. Okay, there's a split here. All right, so I got the Knight of Wands. So now you are taking action, okay? You take an action. I'm getting that there's a lot of back and forth. Some of you are traveling. There's a lot of back and forth energy here. It's kind of like all over the place. Page of Cups in the reverse. Okay, so someone feels as if they, they haven't spoken to you. Okay, 
Yeah, we got the Eight of Cups. You've walked away from something. Yeah, you've moved on. You've moved on. You've left something in the past. And then we got the Hierophant in the reverse. Because maybe you feel like something wasn't done right. We got the Devil and the Queen of Swords. Yikes. And the Chariot. Yeah. You could feel like someone did you wrong. Okay. You feel like something was wrong. And I'm getting that there's some type of missed opportunity here. Like someone's missing out. Why is the Tower here? The Wheel of Fortune. Okay, so there's a big change. So you're contemplating on some type of big change because you're looking back at something like this ain't it. Why is the Five of Cups here? Okay. Six of Pentacles. Somebody's been giving you bad vibes because we got the double here. Somebody's been giving you bad vibes, okay? And somebody's somebody was supposed to give you some money because, look, we got the Six of Pentacles and the Ace of Pentacles. So, I got the Nine of Wands here. So, you've been on the lookout for something to receive something. King of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. But this could also be in regards to like something tangible or something that's material. Okay? So, you regret letting your guard down. That's what this is. Maybe you let somebody borrow something. And now you're regretting it. Why is the Ace of Pentacles here? Why is the Ace of Pentacles here? Why is the Ace of Pentacles here? Why is the Ace of Pentacles? Yeah, the Two of Swords. Okay? They didn't give it back. So maybe you guys let someone borrow something or something in that nature. But somebody didn't give it back. Okay? They ran off. Okay? But I'm getting like there's this communication. Somebody possibly left off and they changed their number. Somebody probably got a new number here. Something to that nature. Okay. But I'm getting that it could be about something that makes you feel stable. Okay. Why is the judgment card here? Queen of Cups. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. You guys energy. But I feel like you you felt like you needed to hurry up and make a decision. We got the Seven of Cups and the Knight of Swords. This is somebody rushing to make some type of decision. Like, it's, it, it's imperative for me to make this decision. And this is going to be a final decision here with this judgment card. This is like a final decision. Okay? You've made up your mind here in the past. Yeah? Some of you have been in communication with the mother or an aunt or grandmother, someone in that nature. Someone uh, very feminine and motherly type energy. Um, and you you decided in the past that you need to hurry up and make a decision. And you need to make it quick. And you was going to make that your final decision. Why is the two of cups? Okay. <laughs> some of you guys went back to a romance from the past. Okay. You know, Venus is in retrograde, so some of you guys' exes may have returned, but I'm getting that there is a union from the past that you may want to resolve. Look at this. Look at this. The sun and the temperance card. Okay, so there's something from the past that you're trying to resolve. I see it here. Okay. You was possibly waiting to, to work. You possibly were working on things. Okay, but there was a breakup here. In the past, and it looks like you're trying to revive that. Why is the Nine of Wands here? Maybe you're waiting for this person to take action towards you. Yeah, see, look, I'm getting that there's just a lot of confusion. I'm getting that there's just a, a lot of playing around, a lot of back and forth. Can't make up your mind. I'm just getting that there's just a, something that you need clarity on. Okay, maybe you don't want to go back to some place. We got the Nine of Cups in the reverse and the Four of Wands. You don't want to go back to some place because this place reminds you of poverty or something that being somewhere where you don't want to be. Okay, and then we got you guys' this energy with the Chariot card. Okay, so you're kind of like all over the place right now. I'm getting that there is just like a bouncing around energy for you. Page of Cups in the reverse. This is someone not being in communication with you. We got the Devil, the Queen of Swords, Knight of Cups. Yeah. Somebody, you you cut communication off with somebody here. Why is the Page of Cups here in the reverse? Yeah. See, look. Ten of Swords. Yeah. You cut communication. Someone feels like you cut communication off with them. Okay. And then we got you and Eight of Cups energy. You walking away. You, 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 you left something behind. Okay. Because it was a burden. You dropped that shit. You dropped it. Okay, the higher in the reverse. This is saying that you feel like things weren't done the right way. 
Okay. Why is the Hierophant in the reverse here? Ooh, okay. Too many cards wanting to pop out. Hierophant in the reverse. Okay, yeah, two of pentacles. I'm getting a lot of confusion. Okay, I feel like some of you guys definitely definitely need clarity on the situation. I'm definitely getting that. We got a two of swords, two of pentacles, seven of cups. There is definitely a lot of confusion surrounded around you. And I think it's a lot of mental clarity. This is something that you are possibly overthinking. I'm getting that there's an overthinking energy here as well. Okay. I feel like you dropped some friends with the Three of Cups, okay? You stopped talking to um, a few people here. Um, but I'm getting that there's just this mental, this mental, uh, see, yeah, Two of Pentacles, Four of Wands. Why is the Four of Wands? For some of you, there's a marriage here. Someone is spying and being nosy. Um, could be family here with that Four of Wands. But I'm keeping, I'm, I'm getting a sense of like, there's this sense of confusion here. Why is the seven of cups? Somebody, I feel like you guys are just playing around. Like, why is the seven of cups? Oh, okay, we got the empress. Wow. Wow, somebody's being a player here. I'm being like you guys are being a player, okay? Why is the Empress here? Why is the Empress here? Yeah, like you have to think about what move you want to make okay because i got you i got you your energy is the four of swords okay so this is taking a break and this is taking time to meditate and think okay think about what move you want to make okay how you want to move um and i, I just feel like right now a lot of you guys energy is kind of like all over the place right now i'm getting definitely getting that there's a lot of uncertainty there's just like a, a mental uh a mental imbalance, like trying to figure something out, gain clarity on something, okay? So let's see what messages we get from the angels, okay? Let's see. What message is there for cancers? Something is not the right time, Cancer. Something is not the right time, okay? And you need to ask your angels for guidance, okay? Yeah, see, look for a sign, okay? You need to ask your angels for assistance, okay? For some of you guys, um, a lot of you guys may be seeing repeated numbers. 111, things in, in that nature. Those are actually your angels and your spirit guides guiding you okay so some of you guys need to ask for help okay ask your angels but something is definitely not the right time and look later on the situation is going to approve i see lots of abundance coming in for you okay see look i got abundance coming in for you and i also got perfect timing all right but what you're going to have to do is communicate clearly exactly what it is that you want okay but i do see big happy changes okay but i feel like you guys had to make some type of choose some type of new direction okay i feel like a new direction had to be has to be taken for this change to come in the way it is i feel like abundance is on the way for you guys most definitely okay everything is about timing and i feel like you need to communicate clearly exactly what it is that you want so the situation can improve and i do feel like um there is big happy changes for you some of you guys may have already been seeing the number 555 okay so let's let's get into it let's see why not the right time is here it's not the right time to ask something or invite somebody because i'm getting that like somebody needs some alone time somebody needs some space so maybe something is not the right time to invite or engage why is the knight of cups here yeah it's not the right time to give anybody anything we got the six of pentacles it's not the right time to give 
okay because i'm getting that what the knight of wands here you could be dealing with the leo sagittarius aries but somebody is just too flighty okay and i feel like it's too much drama see look the five of wands and the ten of wands something is like too much it's too much drama too much he say she say okay so don't give your energy to that don't give don't give your energy to that okay so we're gonna have go to ask your angels we got the moon card wants to come out. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. All right. So, Hierophant in reverse. And the Four of Wands. For some of you, this is definitely a marriage. For some of you, there is a marriage here that, um, that some of you may be deciding to walk away from. For some of you, it is a home that you are leaving. Okay. It's a home situation. It's a family situation. Somebody is walking away here. Somebody's telling their friends that they left, okay, that they're leaving. Why is the Eight of Cups here? <laughs> they're waiting to see if you're going to come back, if you're going to come running back to them. Why is the Eight of Cups here? Yeah. Yeah, see? <laughs> so somebody's been telling somebody that they're going, that they're leaving, that they're done, Okay. Somebody, you may feel like somebody don't want to see you happy. All right, so let's go to this situation will improve. Yeah, it's going to improve because I got temperance here. Could be dealing with the Sagittarius. But I feel like things are going to progress, and it's going to progress quickly. Look at this, the Fool and the Knight of Swords, okay? So things are going to progress quickly. And then with the Temperance card, that's all about balance and healing. So the situation um, is going to get better over time, okay? So, yeah, there's an argument, okay? There's a disagreement here. There's some disagreements that need to be balanced out. Um, and I feel like they are going to get resolved, okay? They are going to get resolved in the near future. So, yeah, we got the world that wanted to come out, okay? So, the closing of that chapter is getting ready to come. And the situation is going to improve, okay? I feel like some truth is going to get ready to come out. And somebody is going to reach out and communicate. The Ace of Swords is most definitely communication as well. There could be some ego issues here with the Six of Wands and the Five of Pentacles. Five of Pentacles. We got you guys this energy, King of Cups. Okay, but I do feel like this situation is going to get better, okay? Whatever this is, I feel like someone gave somebody something or offer. There's some type of offer. That's the Knight of Wands. Okay, I got the star card, which is Aquarius' energy and the five of swords. Um, and I, 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 to, to be honest, I'm getting it like there's just this disagreement. Um, something went bad. Yeah, three of swords. Something went really, really bad here. And then you guys are deciding to walk away. Um, but it looks like this, the, the issue is going to be resolved. Okay, it does look like things are going to be resolved. All right. So... If you guys want to book your very own personal reading with the Empress, that information is going to be in the drop box below, and I will chat with y'all later. Ciao.